everyone, gather around. Chibi Maruko-chan is about to start. Today onwards, this is my territory. You guys better move to another place. <laughs> Those bullies keep expanding their territory. We have to do something about this or we won't have any place to play at all, Boo. <laughs> the same thing happened to me when I was playing in the park with my younger brother. And then this guy started trying to intimidate me and hit me for no reason. He's a terrible person. You know, he must be a real coward to do that. Because you're a weakling. Know what I mean? You do know you're taking my side, but being deliberately rude at the same time. <laughs> Everyone's been bullied by the wild kid from the other town. This is bad. I should be careful. He's a great school in the neighboring town, Boo. This guy's a real piece of work, Boo. I know for a fact that several guys from our class were beaten. I joined that list yesterday. You need to do something about this, Boo. Please. We're begging you. You're the only two people here who can do anything about this bully. Don't worry. We'll handle him. One thing. Do you know where he'll be today? He showed up at Namiki Park yesterday, so I guess the same today, Boo. Namiki Park, got it. Hmm. Hey! Heads up, guys! I've got big news for you! Huh? Onokun and Sukiyama-kun are planning on confronting that wild kid from the neighboring town at Namiki Park today! Wow, wow! wow. Let's go! We have to see what happens at the park. What? You know what Curiosity did to the cat. It's not a good idea to go. Onokun and Sugiyama-kun are gonna fight him. And they're gonna teach him a lesson. Oh my, so refreshing. <laughs> how can she consider an event like this to be refreshing? Just how much stress are you under, Maru-chan? You don't have to come, but I'm going to watch for sure. Uh, Kanawa-kun, do you want to come to the park with me? Sorry, I'm going to watch the Giants game Don't and... do that! <laughs> Watching the Giants play ball is stressful! Summer isn't summer, not without a healthy fight! Beating up bad guys rocks! Go, go! <laughs> Please stay away. It's not good. You're starting to smolder. I'm home! It's a duel. It's a fight. The bad guys are getting stuck tonight! Hey, Mom. I'm gonna be stepping out to watch a face-off tonight. <gasps> I don't think that's a good idea. It's way too dangerous. So, don't. You may get involved. And if you do, you'll get hurt. I'll be all right. I'm just gonna go cheer them on, that's all. I'm not involved at all. Besides, Onokun and Sugiyama-kun will be there anyway. Yes, Maruko, you should go. See it with your own eyes. Witness men in serious battle. I am too old. My time has come and gone for these things. Must hurry, must hurry, must hurry. I'm so lucky. It doesn't seem to have started. No one's here yet, so... Huh? Nagasawa and Fujiki. No one's here yet. 
cool. We won't miss anything then. Mm. Standing around and waiting is boring. Let's play a game to pass time. What game did you have in mind, huh? Mm. I know. Let's play tag. Good idea. Sure. What? You want to play... But it's just three of us. We haven't even started and it's no fun. I have to do something here. Let's play something else, like a word game. Or better yet, let's go exploring. Yeah, exploring sounds like fun. We should do that then. Sure, as long as I get to be the leader of the group. Mm -hmm. He can be surprisingly cunning when he wants to. Mm. Nagasawa Kun is quite a calculative person, and that ensures he'll never lose. Did you just say my goal in life is to never lose? <laughs> I'm right then, you did just say that. Huh. So that's the impression everybody has about me, I'm assuming. Well, it's much better than being considered a loser, don't you think, Nagasawa-kun? Really? I suddenly don't feel like playing this game anymore. Man, there are times when I wish I had some new friends. Hey, you! The kid with the onion head! Uh -huh. Uh -huh. That's him! The wild boy! Didn't I tell you before this is my territory? You refuse to learn your lesson, it seems. <laughs> oh, look, he brought his friends along today. We're so through. <laughs> <laughs> We're surrounded. <laughs> look at these chumps quiver. <laughs> oh, they don't lose control of their functions. <laughs> Someone, help us, please! Somebody help! Uh, it's Sakura-kun and the boys. It looks like the kids from the other town are picking on them. I should check it out. Stop the car. Are you sure that you'll be all right, young master? It will be over soon. All right, be careful. <laughs> <laughs> Crying's not gonna help you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> guess I'm not needed here. Talk about good timing. <laughs> what was that? Hey, who? <gasps> Get ready. We're about to teach you kids a lesson. Big time. Hope you don't have to be home soon. Oh, no, Kun. Sugiyama kun You two talk big, but that's all this is. Get them! Yeah! 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 Uh, uh, you got this! Eat this! <laughs> You've been bullying the helpless. <laughs> You've never been in a real fight before. <laughs> if your friend gets any closer, I'm gonna break your arm, so he better not. Stay back, friend. <laughs> Young master, should we leave or do you wish to stay here? Uh, my assistance isn't needed here. Let's move quickly, or I'll miss the baseball game. Of course, young master. All right, Jingle Park it is then. The young master is skilled in various forms of martial arts, but I'm sorry you didn't get a chance to show them off. That's okay. Martial arts are supposed to be used for self-defense anyway. Well said. I'm so proud of him. He's grown up to be a fine man. Funny thing is, Sakura-kun told me to watch the fight instead of the Giants game. She said watching the ball game would be stressful. <laughs> that girl has an oversimplified view as usual. Oh, man. <laughs> We're done with the small fries. Next up, the big fish. Yeah. Why, you little... Forget it. Those two guys are not to be messed with. He's using a jump rope as a weapon. That's not good. <laughs> Watch it. You almost hit my face with this thing. If you had... Uh, 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 if you're gonna fight, then at least learn how to. Uh, uh, 
Sugiyama, we're done with these guys. Waste of our time. Hey, guys. Nice work. I mean, I knew you guys were tough. That fight was nothing, though. We've been in much tougher fights than that. The tough fights happen to be the ones that are the most fun. You guys are intense. Hey, where did Nagasawa go? Uh -huh. Yeah, wasn't he with us just now? At that time, Nagasawa-kun. You had it coming. Uh -huh. Who's that? Hey, get back here! <laughs> I did it. I'm a fighter, too. I said you had it coming to his face. Ah, I feel so good. Doing that has made me feel like I'm a new person. I feel cool. I can't wait to see Fujuki Kun's reaction. He'll be all, yeah, Nakasawa Kun, you got guts. <laughs> And that night... I can't believe they beat us! Now, Dad, you have to hear the story about the fight today. It might cheer you up. Be quiet! Leave me alone! At that time, Hanawa-kun, who took the time to watch the Giants baseball game at the stadium itself... Young Master, have faith that the Giants will win the next time around. Please. Sakura-kun, you're absolutely right. It really is stressful. Ugh. Mom's treasure. When Mother was younger, she bought this ring at an incredibly low price. But recently, she found this ring is actually quite valuable. Therefore, she's been maintaining it ever since. This is called the Godsend Ring. Wow, that really is quite beautiful. I like the color. Opal, that's the gem. <sighs> cool, when I hold it up to the light, I can see many different colors. It's just like a dream. <laughs> <sighs> this must be your most valuable treasure, right, Mom? That isn't true. My best treasures are you and your sister. <laughs> because it's true. <laughs> right, let's put this back where it'll stay safe. Yeah, good. Take care of that. Because if one day we become poor and don't have food to eat, we can always sell it and support ourselves. It's insurance. <laughs> oh, it's not that easy to exchange for cash, you know. Say, Mom, can I have that ring when I get married and move out of the house? Uh, I'm not so sure. What if your sis wants it? No, you have to give it to me, not her! Promise me I'll get the ring, Mom! Look, I can do this. You want to see another one? She can't do anything like this, can she? I think she'd rather give it to the daughter who doesn't do this. Huh. Let me guess. None of you guys have ever seen a real diamond in your life, have you? The beauty of a diamond is like... Well, the best way to describe it is like a lost angel. Can you imagine its beauty? Hey, I've seen beautiful jewelry before, Hanawa-kun. So which gems have you seen? Rubies, sapphires, or emeralds? You asked, and I'm glad you did. <laughs> You'll be surprised when I tell you. <gasps> uh, I've seen Nepal. <gasps> Sakura-san, to be frank with you, Nepal is actually a country that is located in Central Asia! Uh, oh, my mistake. Uh, wait, what was it? I, I can't remember. Hey, it's all right, baby. <sighs> Just relax. It's not me to put a girl in a position. You don't need to be humiliated any further, okay? Wait, it'll come to me! Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm telling you the truth. Mara-chan, forget about what the others think. I believe you. I'd like to get a look at the jewelry, too. Thank you, Tama-chan. I'm so glad you believe me. You're my only true friend. Could I come to your house today? Huh? Sure. Sounds great. Cool. I'll bring some sweets, too. Good afternoon. Hi there, Tama-chan. Mara-chan. Come in. You ready to have some fun? I brought you those sweets. You brought sweets? Thank you. You didn't need to go to the trouble, though. You sound a bit like a middle-aged woman. 
Right, come on. Let's get started. Which game is first? Let's start by playing Madams. Yeah, that sounds like fun. I think we can both play Rich Madams quite well. Mm -hmm. Playing Housewives. The idea behind this game is to portray the daily lives of rich madams. A rich madam always has some makeup on. Oh. <laughs> you know what's odd, darling? My husband often forgets to change his underwear. It's so middle class of him. Yes, my husband does the same. <laughs> my, how drab. These two might be playing rich madams, but considering the level of conversation, their lives aren't rich at all. And my child is another disappointment to me. She's lazy and clumsy. I've lost all hope. Oh, come now, dear. You know how I envy you having a smart kid. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. I almost forgot. There's something I have to show you, darling. Well, let's go take a look, then. I just can't wait to see it. Have a look at this. My goodness, what a wonderful piece it is. It's so lavish. Oh, no, it's nothing. My husband bought it in Hong Kong during one of his business trips. It was only about five million. <laughs> really? Oh! You should get your husband to pick up something similar. They're so cheap, after all. Yes, I just might. <laughs> Maruko? Uh, it's my mother. Hide the ring. <gasps> Come, Maruko. Tea time. Darling, this is my neighbor who lives three houses down. How's your husband, Hiroshi? He's rather carefree, isn't he? None of your business, madam. This is exquisite. Some more? Madam who lives three houses down, we'd like some more of these, please. I'm sorry, but we're out. Well, of course you are, darling. Is that the time? I should get going. I have to pick up my kids. Don't leave. Sebastian handles all that for us. I'm happy to send him to pick up your kids if you'd like. I wonder who that is. <laughs> Let's do this again. Sure. See ya. Bye. Take care. Maruko, you need to clean your room. Okay. I'm not helping you this time. Come on. You're being mean. Don't be so hard on me. Mom wasn't kidding around. What a mess. <sighs> so troublesome. Uh, before I do this, I should put Mom's ring back in its place. <sighs> I'm really glad I remembered that. It was around here somewhere. Huh? What's this? Well, that's weird. while wrapping yarn around a pair of scissors. Who gave us such a ridiculous idea? So it's... it's obvious. Nobody has ever been able to remember the location of a lost object this way. Maruko? Ah. Just what are you doing? Listen, Mom. You said your biggest treasures are your two daughters, remember? Yes, that's true, and? Okay, that's good. You won't mind losing your second biggest treasure, then. What? I mean, it's silly. I was playing with that ring of yours, and I seem to have misplaced it. <laughs> Why were you playing with something as expensive as that? That's so painful. Now keep looking until you find it. Did you look over there? It's not there. Honey, I need you to help us find the ring. You're kidding with me. Come on. <laughs> the ring isn't anywhere in the house. You'll just have to forget it. Yeah, true. You weren't going to sell it anyway, so... You be quiet. Hey. This is all your fault. <sighs> That's just perfect. I was hoping to get it as a gift when I got married. Thank you. Uh no chance! That ring was coming straight to me! It was mine! How dare you! Uh, how dare you! Hey! You're fighting over something that you lost! <laughs> <sighs> Hon, there's no need to be so upset. He's right! Don't! Dad will 
will go out and buy you something better, Mom. Uh, oh, hold on. You should be doing that. <laughs> you, you disappoint me, Maruko. <laughs> Talk to me now. I think the state mom is in right now is known as having no island to turn to. You learn new stuff every day. Maruko's knowledge base and vocabulary increase thanks to her experiences. One day she won't be able to stand it. <sighs> Sorry, Mom. When I grow up and become a success, I'll get you a ring that's just as good. Please accept my promise and put this behind us. <laughs> Promises like that, Maruko, only apply to those who have prospects. Hi, good evening. Huh? Uh -huh. Someone's at the door. Oh, it's Tama-chan and her mom. Hi, Maru-chan. What is it? Go on, tell her. You remember when we were playing with that ring, Maruko, and your mom suddenly walked in on us? In trying to hide it, the only place I could think of was my pocket. I ended up taking it home by mistake. Uh. <gasps> I'm sorry. This must be valuable to you. Please accept our apologies for you as an apology for the inconvenience caused. Really, there's no need. Maruko is just as much to blame for this. Still, I... Let's play again, huh? Uh, sure. Sorry to bother you so late. Good night! <laughs> oh, that's a relief. Oh. Oh. Maruko, let's have some of the cake she brought. <laughs> oh. Poor Maruko feels rather disgusted and humiliated by the sudden change in her mother's attitude. Were her kids her biggest treasures? <laughs> Tears are welling up in her eyes. <laughs> <laughs>